we're going to define the area of rainfall of area as depicted on the screen using the method of the Thyssen polygons. We have five stations A, B, C, D and E and for each of these stations we have a monthly rainfall figure. To come up with, aerial, with the aerial rainfall we'll connect the locations of the stations with lines as follows and define the middle the middle of each line there is a middle 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 and through the middle of the lines we will draw lines perpendicular which will set out the area represented by each station. <coughs> For example, the area around station B is the area that is hatched in yellow And we can count the squares, which will be 18 squares. We can do the same for each area, for example, area D. Count the squares, area D. 22 and a quarter square. The same with area A. 18.25. B, C, 18.25. And E, also 16.25 square. <coughs> which add up to the total of 93 squares. Aerial rainfall is now calculated as a proportion of the area for each station. For example, station A is 18.25 squares over the total times the rainfall station A. The same for the rainfall from station, the contribution of the rainfall from station B. 18 over 93 times 117. Station C. Station E. Times seventy seven. 
and if we make the calculations this comes to 100 millimeters per month for the aerial rainfall of the area that is shown.